people here to enter the Rush Duel Team Battle Royal? Yeah, I believe they are. Oh, Sabu Ramen's team is here. So is Scoop's troop and Janko's. There's the Duel Dinosaur Club. And straight from space, it's the Duel Stronauts. But there's my favorite trio. A Rush Duel Froze Cone, a Taco Duel Witch, and a Rush Duel Dog on a Stick. If this was an eating tournament, we'd win in a landslide. It's that? No way. It's Kid Goha. And Lil Rush. Those mascots are flying off the shelves. I should get some before they run out. <laughs> uh. Too bad I got the last two Gavins, so none for you. Oh, thanks. Gohas pulled out all the stops to make sure the Battle Royal is the best tournament ever. And you can still join, you know. Huh? I can still sign you up for my team, bro. I'd rather be in the stands, rooting Nah, you. forget that. We don't need you up there. Gavin's already our school leader, so he could be our cheerleader too. Or Roman, she yells really loud, so she'd be perfect. Hey, look. Uh, what is it, Yuga? Look over there. Uh. The school budget to cook 77 pounds of blue curry for our victory party. I must say, your plan is absolutely brilliant. Since eliminating rush duels has proven to be impossible, you propose to take control of it instead. And it will be easy to destroy what we control. <laughs> By starting the Battle Royal, we are declaring that Goha Enterprises is the true creator of Rush Duels. And even if Yuga Odo protests, no one will listen to him. Because who could possibly believe a child over us? <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, I'll go pick up that Lil Rush souvenir that you wanted. I hope they haven't sold out. The size of this crowd! Everyone is totally psyched for the Battle Royal! Looks like that notebook was totally on point! Correct. It is the perfect plan to destroy Rush Duels. What? But who came up with it? Huh? Mimi? <laughs> Why are you dressed up as Kid Goha? <laughs> uh, anyway, Mimi, did you see a tall hooded stranger pass this way? <laughs> you sure, Mimi? Cause we think he's here to disrupt the battle royal because Goha's up to no good with this tournament. <laughs> How do they know it's me? How does Yuga know of Goha's plans? Wait a sec. Yuga had a notebook where he kept all his ideas too. Just like the one I got. And the doodles kind of sort of look like the same. So did Yuga come up with this plan to destroy Rush Duels? But why would Yuga want to do that? <laughs> Don't you dare lie to me, Yuga! Was it like your idea for Goha to hold this Rush Duel Battle Royal? No, it wasn't me. Uh, are you telling me that this wasn't Goha's idea? Goal is Sabu's future! Huh? I have historic news! Registration for the Goha Rush Duel Team Battle Royal is now open! Hey, let's go register for the tournament! Right! Come on! <sighs> Confirmed! Team King Luke's Kings is now officially entered in the Goha Rush Duel Team Battle Royal. Step one's done, now step two, win the finals! I think there's a bunch of steps in between, Luke. That's not fair, Dad Nabbit! Huh? But why isn't Peach Drop allowed to enter the tournament? He has every right to join and be a part of our dueling squad! Sorry, but you can't have pets on your team. He is not a pet! Why isn't Asana on your team? Well, Yuga, she was, but... I'm sorry, but I have to drop out because I have a cold. <laughs> I'll bring your medicine. Don't you dare. I mean... <laughs> you have to stay there to compete. The pitch drop can take my place. Now go win the crown for the Heavy Cavalry Duel Club and make me proud. Uh, but without the third duelist, we can't compete. Join their team, bro! Uh, huh? Are you serious? Hold on, if Yuga joins our team, then he can't be on yours, Luke! The one thing worse than not having Yuga on my team is if he was on another team! 
But bro, what would be even way worse than that is if a bunch of my friends couldn't compete because I was being selfish. <sighs> and I can't let that happen. <sighs> Yuga. Will you join our team? I don't know. I already planned to sit out this tournament. It's him! Yuga, huh? That's you know, oh, no. Yuga himself. Wait, that's the game we rushed us. Yuga's in the battle royal? This is so I'm gonna get to duel the creator of Rush Duels? Sorry, but I'm not competing in the tournament. And why not? <sighs> I've never known you to be a spectator. Hey, I've seen that man before. Same here. That's the guy who caused a ruckus when he interrupted Yuga's duel against Roa at Big Seven Arena. That isn't just any guy, that's Otis! Or should I say, that's a hologram of Otis, because he never actually shows up in person. What? A pigeon can't stand on a hologram, so that means it's really him! Hey, bro. <laughs> Luke, would you get back here? What are you doing here, Otis? Oh, I was just in the neighborhood, Yuga. Seeing what's going on, getting a few snacks. Come on now, Otis. You never show up unless something big's going on. <laughs> I guess that's true. I know you think Goha started this battle royal to trick people into thinking they created rush duels. But what if I told you there's another reason? The real reason. The real reason? All right, what is it, Otis? I will tell you. If you defeat me! Okay! I didn't think I'd be dueling today, but I guess I am! <laughs> I cannot wait to find out what's really going on behind the scenes at Goha, Otis! You really shouldn't talk as if you have already won the duel, Yuga. Get, Get ready, ready for, for the rush. rush! Allow me to go first. I draw! I summon Feral Imp in attack position! and then I'll tribute it. From the birthplace of doom and despair comes the feared and fabled fiend whose very name strikes terror in the hearts of duelists everywhere. Born from the apparitions of 10,000 nightmares, a legend long unseen looms again as I tribute summon. Summon Skull! Uh, oh. Feels special? It's not every day you get to see such a legendary monster in person. Yeah, I feel special because I'm not dueling against it. That's one of the strongest monsters in the history of the game. But if anyone can find a way to destroy it, it'll be Yuga. <laughs> I'll play a spell that can only be used when Summon Skull is on my field. Majinrai, the Striking Storm! Do you have a spell card that combos with Summon Skull? Yes, and it inflicts 1,300 points of damage. <laughs> Yuga's already taken damage! And he hasn't even had a turn! Now I'll set one card and end my turn. So cool. Okay, it's my turn. Here goes. I'll start off by summoning Mystic Healer. <laughs> Next, I'll use his effect to draw a card. Then I'll use my Mystic Dealer to tribute summon. Lead the way, Seven's Road Witch. <laughs> I discard a card to activate Seven's Road Witch's effect! Yeah! Oh, yeah! She allows me to special summon this! A wall! A mountain! Not even a planet can block my way! Nothing will stop my road to victory! Let's go! Seven's Road Magician! When these two get together, my witch gains 400 attack points, and my magician has his own effect, Elemental Road! He gains attack points for every attribute in his graveyard. Fire, water, dark, and earth, that makes four! So if you do the math, Seven's Road Magician gains 1,200 attack points! That monster is now stronger than Summon Skull! After I set a card face down, I'll attack with Seven's Road Magician! 
Your summoned skull is summoned no more! But he won't be gone for long since you triggered this trap! Ah. Otis had that card ready to go! As if he knew exactly what Yuga was going to do! Archfiend's revival revived Summon Skull from my graveyard! <laughs> Summon Skull is back! And Yuga's back to square one. I end my turn! So my monsters power down! What a duel! I don't know who's gonna win this! This Otis fella seems to know what Yuga's gonna do even before Yuga does. How's Yuga gonna beat someone who knows him better than he knows himself? <laughs> Get ready, Yuga, because your trouble is only getting started. When Summon Skull is on my field, I can activate this spell card. Masenko, the Lashing Light! Another card combos with Summon Skull? This spell destroys any monster on your field whose level is 8 or lower. They're both destroyed! This is bad! Oh, bro! <gasps> oh, things aren't looking good, but I still have one last trick up my sleeve. Or should I say, on my field? Hmm. Don't think I forgot about your face down card, you. I summon Rogue of Archfiend! Next, I'll activate his effect. Did that monster just sacrifice himself? In exchange for this monster's existence, Summon Skull is no longer affected by your card's effects, including that card you have set, Yuga. Everything that Otis does is to keep his Summoned Skull alive! How is Yuga ever gonna get rid of it now? I'll set two cards. And now, Summoned Skull, it's time to attack Yuga directly. Lightning Strike! Ah! He's down to 200 life points! Yes, but as long as Yuga has a single life point, you know he's going to keep fighting. Yuga's getting crushed! Unbelievable! How could he be losing when he invented this game? Because he didn't. I heard Doha invented Rush to Rush. I heard that too. Yuga's lying to take all the credit. Whoa, yeah. lying his whole time. Don't him. listen to him, bro! Yuga. Huh? When you and I met for the first time, you were so full of potential. I watched as you and your rush duel was changing the world. You were leading the revolution to a whole new era of dueling. But recently, as your rush duel has evolved beyond my wildest expectations, you have not. Do you know why I can anticipate your strategies? Because you're playing the same cards since day one. Face it, you don't have your heart in the game anymore. You've proven that by refusing to participate in the battle royal. The Yuga I knew, or I thought I knew, would never turn down a duel. So if you won't step up, then you should step aside and leave rush duels to those who really care, like Goha Enterprises. What? Goha? Yes! At least they were willing to sponsor this tournament, while you run from the competition! <sighs> hmm. Well, Otis, you can believe what you want to believe, but I bet I can change your mind! It's my turn! <laughs> I draw! I summon Light Sorcerer! And I'll use him to tribute summon this! Even seven solid doors can't barricade me! Nothing will stop my road to triumph! Strike hard! Seven's Road Warlock! Check that out! It's a new Seventh Road monster! Next up, I discard a trap card to activate my Warlock's effect! <sighs> Seventh Revival! I get to retrieve a Dark Attribute Spellcaster that's level 7 or higher from my graveyard and add it to my hand. And if that monster happens to be Seventh Road Magician, then I can get another Spellcaster from my graveyard that's level 6 or higher! I tribute Seven's Road Warlock to tribute summon the Seven's Road Witch I just got back! But when you summon a monster, I'm allowed to activate my trap card, Delight of the Mighty! Uh, it 
gives my summon skull 100 attack and defense points for each level that your Seven's Road Witch possesses. Yuga Seventh Road Witch is a level six monster. That means Otis gains 600 attack points. I discard a card from my hand to activate Seventh Road Witch's effect. Call out Seventh Road Magician. They're back together again. Way to go! go. I activate the Trap card, Moraime, the Igniting Inferno. Moraime's effect will deal me 100 points of damage for every monster you currently have in your graveyard, Yuga. Huh? He has seven monsters there. That's 700 damage. Uh. Why would Otis activate a Trap card that lowers his own life points? I know. Because Moraime has another effect. It returns all those monsters back to your deck. Wait, all his monsters? Yuga's graveyard is now empty. That means Seven's Road Magician can no longer use his effect to power up. This was his one chance. There goes any hope for a comeback. <gasps> Don't be so sure. Huh? The Yuga I know never, ever, ever, ever gives up. That's right. Because you see, the thing about Rush Duels is, even when everyone thinks the match is over, there's always a chance to turn the duel around. And like you, Otis, I have a new card that specifically combos with my monsters, too. Seven's Twin Burst! Check that out! Yuga's got a new spell! You're right! My magician gains attack points equal to Seven's Road Witches, giving him a boost of 2,000 attack points. What a great card! Yuga found a different way to power up his magician! Didn't expect that! Way to go, bro! Guess I still have some new tricks you don't know about, huh, Otis? Hmm. Seven's Road Magician, attack, summon, skull! Seven, magic attack! And now for the final blow! Go, Seven's Road Witch, Seven's Slinger! Well done, Yuga. You've proved that you're still evolving your game, and that Rush Tools are still in good hands with you. I'm excited to see where your road will lead. Maybe it will take you beyond the stars. Otis, you promised if Yuga won the duel, you'd tell us the real reason why Goha started the tournament. Huh? Yeah, so spill the beans so we can stop Goha from ruining our fun. Right, Yuga? Or maybe it'll be more fun if Otis doesn't tell us and we find out why for ourselves. And the only way I can do that is by entering the Rush Duel Team Battle Royal. Oh, you're entering? You still okay if I take Asana's place on your team? Huh? Uh, of course! Yes, sir! <laughs> Target acquired, target acquired, target acquired, target acquired, target acquired. Don't move, Otis! We finally found you! You made a big mistake thinking you could crash this tourney. You know how long you're gonna be locked up? Forever! And then six years on top of that! We gotta do something, bro! Don't worry. If you stay on your road, there's no limit to where you'll go. Well, Luke, I'm off. Uh, yeah. From this point on, guess we're rivals. Uh. Let the best team win. Uh. Uh. Yeah, let the best team win. Sounds good. Uh. Ceremonies are this way. Excuse me, but you have to park your vehicles outside the arena. Excuse me. Excuse me! Well, Luke? Are you ready to duel? Yeah! Scanning! Scanning! Target not found! Permission!
caution to proceed further into Melton. Granted. <laughs> Doha Enterprises will soon be ours.